The Wikipedia page on the bushfires lists that the fires raged from June 2019 to May 2020 and had burned an area of 186,000 kilometers squared or about four and a half times the size of the Netherlands. It is likely that numerous species have gone extinct during these wildfires especially considering that about three quarters of Australia's threatened wildlife are plants, often with relatively small ranges. Australia and California are not the only regions that are plagued by fire. Last year, large parts of the Amazon were on fire as well. There is a difference, however. In Brazil, the fires have been much more rare historically, and many of of the over 40,000 fires likely have been the result of slash and burn, where farmers claim land by clearing forest with fire. Climate change has likely worsened the duration of these fires. And in Brazil, the fires are not limited to the Amazon. Perhaps even more surprising is that this year, also large parts of the Brazilian Pantanal wetlands have been on fire. This time lapse by the Revelator shows where you can find the Pantanal and tracks the number of square kilometers burnt with data from NASA. The cumulative area burnt is estimated to range between 12 and 16 percent of the Pantanal. As mentioned, the fires in Brazil seem less directly caused by climate change. Rather, the weakening of environmental protection laws and monitoring resulting from Bolsonaro's election seem to be the underlying cause here. I have included another video by Fox providing a recent summary.